This is Dylan with Bulldog Rooter, and I'm at 6715 North Drumheller, Spokane, Washington, 99208. And this is a sewer video inspection. I'm pushed all the way out to the city main, and we're about 60, 67 feet out, falling back. It's a good offset in the pipe right there. And looks settled too so this water is just pulling up it's not going to drain down there is some pretty good root growth through there I'm cameraing through a three inch clean out in the basement and this is four inch diameter pipe it's a good little offset right there too you can see the it's not a smooth transition at all I actually have to jam my camera past that. But that's like five feet from the city main. You can see the root growth. With concrete pipe, it's very maintainable. Um, normally recommend annual maintenance just so that these tree roots don't really, you don't allow the tree roots to grow very long and very heavily throughout your line. They can really do some damage. Every three foot section of pipe there's a joint which the tree roots are very capable of growing in through. Come back. What I mean by maintainable is just, you know, it's concrete pipe, so you can, you're able to send, you know, a full-size diameter blade through here. You should be able to. Um, if the transitions or obstructions are forgiving, or if they allow you to. But there is Orangeburg sewer pipe around nowadays, too, uh, installed in the 30s through the 70s. It's just compressed tar paper sewer pipe. So, that pipe is not maintainable and you don't want to cable it unless you absolutely have to. But this you can, you know, do preventative maintenance once a year. There's another joint right there. You can tell the tree roots are growing through. I just ran my two inch blade all the way out to the city main and brought it back. Brought back a little handful of roots. some tree root growth. It's not too bad. There's some more. I'm going to try to run my my three inch blade and clean this up a lot better. That joint is pretty good. And this is the cast iron to concrete transition. It's pretty root bound. I think this is probably where the restriction was. Hopefully a 3 inch blade will clean this up much better, but this is yet again 4 inch diameter pipe. If you guys had proper access, which is a 4 inch clean out, um, we could put one outside for you. Um, that would be ideal so that we don't have to pack our equipment in here. That's always a thought. And that would just help us to, to better maintain your pipe and get the most efficient cleaning possible. And that is your video inspection.